Okay, so there's that. It is Saturday, the day before Mother's Day, and I was called by Spirit to come and do a meditation. And I'm sharing with you guys because I know you are on such a big journey as well. You're doing the work. Oh, I almost recorded this, this meditation and I should have, but I didn't. So I'm going to share it with you anyway. This is my notebook where I started doing sketches of my meditations. No artist, just rough sketches. This is a selenite wand I used with me. And as per request, Hecate's wheel. When I say as per request, the deities request that I check this out. So in this Follow the Raven meditation, I've done several, several times before. I'm at my nebula in the universal space. I'm sure you can read that. Um, in the observer position. So what the raven showed me to observe. So the layers of the energetic universe. I'm sharing it here first in case anybody else has had these sort of things. So I saw the golden pillars of entrance right here. We have the ethereal, ethereal space, just like where we can access through daydreams. Um, I saw the halls of the Akashic Records going all the way down. Like I can't draw, but it was so deep. It went in like for for infinity into the each of these layers it went infinity into the back part of the library the halls the universe wherever this is right and there was lines of hallways on both sides this one also had hallways on each side so this is the halls of records different than the akashic records i don't know higher up knowledge maybe um those that have ascended can access it through meditation and dreams Okay, but you have to have ascended and access this halls in order to get into this halls. And then beyond that, we have energy waves three. This is a violet spectrum, like a violet purple, right? Um, what does it say there? Growth. How do we get in there? I don't know what I wrote. Growth and something else. I don't, I don't know what that word is. It looks like mute, but it's not mute. Hold on. Okay, that actually says invite. So you need to be invited, spiritual guide, um, joined, or joined by something spirit in, in that level to get into here. So whether it be invite through ascension or invite through passing, actually, this is um, quite possible where that can happen. Energy Waves 4 was orange and pink, and then... Um, I don't know. It, it didn't show me more about that. So I guess I don't know about that. It's not my time to know about that. And then up above is a bigger space, less, less defined, but it absolutely was energy. And then in behind this is like the galactic energy background of the whole space of like the God energy that is all the energy that is in the universe. So that was pretty intense. Um, I actually had some really big crying breakthrough moments with breath work through this meditation and I swear it's changed, but that just could be like the butterfly effect that's going on here in spirit land. But, um, just wanted to share with you guys, it is a big, big, big shift that's happening. And as we do the work, things open up for us. So never be afraid of coming into your own power and happiness and sometimes we just have to have that faith in the universe that it will be shown to us. So I just asked to see my way. I asked to see my vision. I asked to see where do I go from here? And this is what the universe gave me. So happy Mother's Day weekend. It's an interesting shift. Mercury comes out of retrograde on Sunday. So expect, remember when I said it's like shoving all that stuff from the past and now it's just, it's dealt with and opening up that space and welcoming in the future and that is just ready to happen right now. And so I just thought it'd be cool that I shared this with you before I sound like a crazy person putting it out there. So if you're experiencing anything like this as well, um, yeah, it's actually definitely a thing. All right. Love you guys. <laughs> Here we go. Let the journey begin.